Hello everyone, Kiwi Who is back here. Welcome back to Septic Tales. To behind me are a lot of leather which we will be using on the next mod pack on the list of quests to be done here in this mod pack, which will be Totemic Mod. It's a mod that uses ceremonies, music, instruments, and all buffs and debuffs they use totems spiritual magic of nature however we are not going to maybe go into the technicalities for now today what I want is of course continue the mod pack I want to make the TP and this drums and the other instruments while making a settlement going up here to our flower biome over here it's a really nice area in which I want to be able to use we will be making a path from here to down there to our first cave the totemic mod will be using a lot of new items which will be able to help our primitive automation especially the buffaloes here in the ancient animal section of the quest they are really really large animals in septic ages which is why we need an open land and how about while designing it also anyway I will do the patchwork for now. I will be cleaning up trees and putting all the flowers on the right places. Anyway, see you later. Hello everyone. We are back in our working of the clearing for our mini settlement. And I wanted to finish up right now because we have done in the durability of our bedspread now what we have here we made a path over here some totems from the totem mod and mm. I brought home some cows from the wilderness this will be useful in mm. making them or like turning them into buffaloes mm. Now from our path here, we made a dirt staircase, this is the only stairs we can make as of now and make some small like tiki torches at the side, they don't run out like the normal torches that we have in stage 0. Now I have here made some crafting tables for what we are going to need to place in our settlement one is the tipi which will be our very own bed like home and the totemist drum this will aid us for making or starting a ceremony now these are the different um, uh, recipes that we are going to be needing this is the TP I think this is the drum and I forgot what this one I think this is the lead right here yeah this is the lead this TP and oh. I wanted to make here for the achievement there we go or advancement yeah and this is the drums and here is the lead and it's not doing anything. Oh, I think I needed a different kind of cordage. Wait, what is this recipe? I forgot. What is this recipe? For anyway. Hmm. Let's check. Leather cordage, leather. Okay, let's see. It's a saddle, but I need leather cordages. Okay, well, let's just plop our teepees. It's about to 
go night time really like this uh way we have here it's simple it's a start going to cover this with more stone i guess for accent so that it will show coming from the ocean and just right going up now if we get closer to our totem tool that i made right there we will which we will explain in a while we will have a night vision effect each animal here represent an effect we open up our inventory right now we all have that effect with us as long as we are nearby I think and yeah we have ocelot so this thing won't really explode okay plop down our TP right here and oops I think it's because of that one there oops okay a little bit of lag not there. We shouldn't place it hor uh, diagonally anyway. Yeah. Okay, let's place it a little bit closer. There, there we go. This is our bed. Right click and then we sleep. Now, uh, as I said before, we will explain this uh, in a short. Uh, basically, oh, it gave us a totem as a quest. Okay, anyway. Basically, we need a totem whittling knife. It's not that hard to make. The whittling knife is only flake flint and a stick, which you will uh, unlock once you finish that, I think, one or two quests. If you shift and then right click, you choose which one you are going to plop down. Uh, for the totems, you will obviously first need a totem base, which will be at the very start. Okay. If you you can only make six blocks high totem poles, and if you stack upon one, or like three rabbits, rabbits enhances jump height, and then I think this is wolf. Wolf is buffs your strength. Enderman is the night vision. Horse up here is speed and up there I placed ocelot so that creepers won't explode just like a while ago. And yeah, I think there's also bat which will well make you I think negate fall damage. And then there's squid for water breathing and buffalo for mining speed. Then cow is for like turtle effect. High defense but slow moving. Anyway, we will plop down here. I guess we'll place a mm. buffalo. Oops. Mm. There. A buffalo, I think let's place two. And then I want to place an ocelot. Mm. Just in case. I don't want thing. And it's free. It's really good. Mm. It's really a powerful uh, mechanic from the totem mod then let's just plop around maybe two rabbits there okay there we go it's, it's higher than before because you'll only get jump height one then jump two uh, for two rabbits two buffaloes faster mining speed Okay, now let's plop down our totem drum and let's start doing at least one ceremony. One, what we will be doing right now is that ceremony for making the cedarwood plant. What we will need are some saplings. Let's just go back and get some saplings. Should have a lot of saplings here. Go. Any saplings will do, I think. There. 
And why I did that is so that I can place a wind chime. Wind chimes will help. I can't place it yet, uh, like aesthetically, but this will do for now. Go. I think, yeah, let's do it like that. But it has to be near the drum. To register. There we go. Okay, we have our rattle here, which is just using sugar cane. That's why it's really good to have your sugar canes intact at the beginning. Let them grow. It's just in easy. Just make jingles, and it also makes the jingle tr dress. It helps with the melody. Okay, now that we have our birch sapling, let's check for the rite of spring. Where is it? Uh, ceremonies. There we go. And the rite of spring. The rite of spring will help with growth and fertility of both villagers and animals. While also just as long as you have plopped down a food or emerald somewhere nearby, it will automatically feed to all of them that needed it. And if there are saplings nearby, there will become a red setter sapling. So it's a flute and a totemist drum. Okay. Okay. Or I think we can use the rattle here and then the jingle dress. I think we go for this and drum. Uh oh. Let's plop this here and let's do it again. One for one. Then. And this one. This is wrong again. Okay, it's this one and that. There we go. There. I'm not sure if it's plopped down or is it supposed to be like that. Anyway, it's not that hard. Okay, it's plopped down. That's fine. Okay, now that we have our two setters, let's do another one. Oh, it's still... Okay. That's nice. Next, we are going to do another ceremony now for actually... Um growing the sapling another really powerful um use of the totemic mod and it is the fertility mod uh i mean fertility ceremony it's a different kind of fertility this is for plants let's see it's the, is it the suffix? Yeah, it's the Zafkil Waltz. It's for eggs and plants. And this doesn't need anything. Unlike the Rite of Spring, it needs food for breeding. Mm. This one doesn't need that, maybe mm. thinking of like bone meal or something like that. Just need to plop it right down where you need it to go. And let's just place it somewhere nearby. Mm -hmm. Let's remove this one. Then plop this around. It uh, won't reach here, but uh, it's just good for it to grow. There we go. There. Let's place it. Okay, let's check how this is going to go. It's wind chime and flute. Let's eat first. Apple. Okay, okay it's that and flute. This and flute. Okay. We are here for our cedar wood to grow fast. Let's see if this will grow. Yeah, here we go. It grew. Okay, it grew. It's it's really small, huh? There. Forgot if we can breed the buffaloes, but we have e an even number of cows, which will be helpful if we actually can. Now let's see how we can make the buffalo. 
Here we go, totem best day six and the buffalo. Mm -hmm. Buffalo dance ceremony. Buffalo dance. Here we go. Regret something, never mind. It's total mist, drum, and wind chime. Do I need anything else? Okay. In the okay, let's see. in the lore for totems, buffaloes are an Indian or like a spirit animal, which is why they don't appear in the world and only can be done from transforming their ancestors or predecessors, which is the cow, back to their hulky, bulky self, the buffalo. Okay, let us turn them into buffaloes. It was flute, right? And oh no, it's drum and strum. Okay, and okay. And as you can see, I'm jumping all around. It's just for us to jingle, jingle our way. There we go. Look at those little things. Oh, I only made two. I don't know why it only made two. Mm. And that's good enough. Okay, we can't grow our buffaloes just yet, but at least we have them. We can take them out as early as now, but we'll be nice and let them grow first. Because we might need. We can't. I am not confident in doing the last one here. The boss by cock. This guy is irritatingly hard. It's like. Put all of the totems together, and yeah, that guy has it all. Anyway. Please, that's a good introduction and start for totem mod. Uh, we have done some ceremonies, our small little um, outpost settlement here. We have the tipi huts, the totems, and our growing buffaloes. That's already a large, big achievement for this episode. And that is all for this episode, folks. See you again next time. See ya!